With the Christmas season coming right around the corner, it's very important to know how to wrap your own gifts so that you don't have to have someone else do it for you and ruin the secrets. So today I'm gonna go over the materials you need to wrap your own presents, the step-by-step -step process of wrapping your own presents, and the benefits of wrapping your own presents. Starting off with the materials you're gonna need, you're gonna need your present, a pair of scissors, see-through tape, because opaque tape, like duct tape, would make the present look bad in the end. And then wrapping paper, preferably with a grid pattern on the non-festive side. Now we're going on to the step-by-step -step process. The reason you want a grid pattern on the non-festive side is to make it easier to measure the present and make it even on all sides. So when, when the present covers over half of the box, then you know that you need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven squares on each side. And then you can move the present down and see how much wrap paper you need to cover one side of it. And I need about three squares, so I'm going to come back over to this side and cut three squares right here. And from there, you can finish your cuts. And then you can toss your paper to the side because you don't need any more. From here, you put one layer over. And this tape doesn't really matter because you're not going to see it. So you don't need to make it look super good. And then when you put the other side over, I like to crease the sides to make the present look more square. And then when you get to the sides, fold it down and make a triangle with the paper and then crease it on both sides and then push it to the side of the present and crease it and then it's your choice but you can tape it here just to make sure it stays on both sides And then you can fold it up. To the side of the present. And then you just do the same thing on the other side.
and now your presents wrapped. So now I'm going to go over the benefits of learning how to wrap your own presents. Um, the main benefit being that you can't see what the gift is because it's a secret. Um, now you could just put your gift into a cardboard box, but you know, with the season, you want it to look festive and nice, and it just makes it look like a lot more effort has been put into the present. Um, and you don't have to chance ruining the secret by having someone else wrap it that might tell them what the present is. Um, so today we went over the materials you need to wrap a present, the step-by-step -step process of wrapping a present, and the benefits to wrapping your own presents. Thank you.